You're watching Kiddos World TV! Hello there! Welcome back to Kiddos World TV! I am Miss P. Join me today for a fun learning session about baby animals! Yay! As you all know, we share this beautiful planet with tons of animals living in different habitats. Which means, there are a lot of baby animals that are born. Don't you think it's super fun to learn more about them? Yeah! Okay, kiddos, let's begin! Woohoohoo! Did you know that the baby lion is called a cub? A lion's cub is born with its eyes closed. Their eyes will only be open 3 to 11 days after birth. Wow! Another cute thing about cubs, just like humans, they are born without teeth. <laughs> That's incredible, right, kiddos? Yeah! A baby horse is called a foal. Did you know that the foal can already stand, walk, and trot within two hours after birth? Wow! They're truly amazing! Excellent! A baby cow is called a calf. Calves are born with very sharp teeth and they can also start mooing shortly after birth. How cute! A baby goat is called a kid. A kid has unusual rectangular shaped pupils which helps them to have fuller range of vision compared to other animals. Cool! Baby goats are mammals, so they drink their mother's milk. <laughs> a baby kangaroo is called a joey. <laughs> Newborn joeys are cradled in their mother's pouch for about six to ten months until they are old enough to leap around on its own. Aww, how adorable! <laughs> a baby dog is called a puppy. A newborn puppy is born deaf and blind with no teeth. They can only open their eyes 10 to 14 days after birth. That's super cool to know! Wow! <laughs> a baby cat is called a kitten! Kittens look super cute and cuddly after birth. <laughs> and did you know that kittens are born with blue-gray eyes? It will only change into their permanent eye color after a year. That's quite marvelous! Great! A baby chicken is called a cheek. Did you know that cheeks use their tooth to break free from their shell? But soon after hatching, they lose this egg tooth. Incredible, isn't it? Yeah! A baby pig is called a Piglet! Did you know that piglets can already recognize their mom's voice when they are as young as two weeks old? How smart! Alright! A baby goose is called a gosling. Did you know that a gosling is hatched with its eyes open? Aside from that, this beautiful baby goose can already swim right away, 24 hours after birth. How awesome! Wow! A baby duck is called a duckling. Did you know 
that ducklings can already fly within five to eight weeks of hatching. Wow! That's super cool, kiddos! Excellent! <laughs> a baby deer is called a fawn. A fawn is born with spotted coloring on their skin, which helps them to be camouflaged on land. A newborn fawn can already take its first steps just 30 minutes after they are born. How extraordinary! Wow! A baby mouse is called a pinky. It is because of their rosy pink tones as newborns. And did you know that pinkies can tell the temperature using their whiskers? Not only that, their heart can beat up to 632 times a minute. Oh, wow! Cool! A baby rabbit is called a kit. A newborn kit is blind, deaf, and hairless. It can only open its eyes 10 days after birth. But a kit can already be independent from its mother in just 30 days. How cool! Alright! A baby gorilla is called an infant. Did you know that infants usually stay in physical contact with their moms for about five to six months? Their mothers do this to keep the infant safe. Aww, that's adorable. Don't you agree, kiddos? Yes! A baby turtle is called a hatchling. It is because they are hatched from eggs. Baby turtles, just like cheeks, have an egg tooth that they use to break tree from their shell. But they eventually lose it an hour after use. How awesome! <laughs> a baby swan is called a signet. Signets are fantastic baby animals that can immediately swim after birth. And it takes about three to four months for signets to take their first flight. That's incredible! Wow! A baby owl is called an owlet. An owlet is extremely fluffy and covered in very thick white or gray down feathers. Baby owls eat whatever their parents feed them, but they will tear their food into smaller pieces first before the owlet can swallow it whole. So cute! <laughs> that ends our lesson for today, kiddos. I hope you had fun learning about these cute and adorable baby animals. But before we end this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. You can also search for Kiddos World TV here on YouTube for more educational videos like this. Bye kiddos and see you at the next one. Bye! Bye Miss B! <laughs> Having fun kiddos? Please click subscribe for more learning and fun! See you in the next videos!